So here we are again, um, live streaming, streaming again, um, but this time uh, rather excitingly with our new, uh, our completely new setup. Uh, we were using an Intel i5, the old Intel i5 based desktop PC last week and um, for a flight sim. And uh, we were losing some frames on the on the stream. No great surprise because it was really stretching that machine, but we've got a new, um, i9 based processor based uh, machine that is lightning lightning quick so we're testing it out um, today with Assetto Corsa this amazing uh, racing simulation so uh, and as well I've got the Oculus Rift hooked up to this we just got this working today and I have to say I'm quite this is the first time I've used VR and it's uh, quite an amazing immersive experience um, it really does feel as though you're in the cockpit of, of the car. I've just done a couple of laps and that's what we're going to do now. Um, and then we're going to jump into a race. So I am racing uh, a 2014 F1 Ferrari. So I'm just going to put these on. Let's, um, let's give it a go. Apologies, I won't be able to respond on chat. <laughs> I'm going to be doing 200 miles an hour. Down, down the straight so I won't have a, a time to look at the chat window but I will do afterwards or maybe after the practice session or after the race so uh, fingers crossed let's see how this goes so a bit of practice to start off with Did I mention that we're at Spa? So gentle outlap. Let's warm the tyres up. Now this is my, say this is my favourite circuit. It's got everything. Changes in uh, elevation, long, long straights, punishing uh, deceleration. Oh, uh, apologies! I was pressing on the wrong pedal. I didn't. <laughs> I was pressing on the clutch. <laughs> I made that mistake earlier today. Anyway, we're in the practice session, so it doesn't matter. We'll let these guys go by. All right, here we go. Let's tuck in. Oh, and it's the funny thing is when you're uh, I've noticed straight away is your body your eyes are seeing this and your brain is telling you your body should be experiencing g-forces which it's not. So it's quite confusing. So we've got the graphics turned up to ultra on all aspects of the setup. So I'm just going to do uh, a couple of laps and then have a look and get some feedback on uh, whether the stream is working okay. And my driving, which I, I know is terrible, although I do know this, oh I forgot that was the bus stop. Chicane, you should slow down for chicanes. I <laughs> can't scratch my nose. <laughs> right. Here we go. Let's see if we can do a, a tidy lap. Down the hill. This is flat out. Bit wobbly. Pick our breaking point here. Bit early. Very 
bring it into the middle corner accelerate out better this lap a bit tidier Somebody's retired on the left. Full of flat out, flat out, say off the grass, a gentle lift. We're coming up to the chicane. Stamp on the brakes. Downs first. Let's pull over. Get out of everybody's way. Ooh. Let's check the chat. <laughs> Leisure suit, Larry. Hey, Al, how you doing? Streaming fine is an option to race in a Ford Transit. I haven't seen a Ford Transit, but it wouldn't surprise me if there was this great. This game is great for modding, so there's loads of other stuff that you can download and and install. <clears throat> so anyway. good to hear that uh, it's all good so what we're going to do is uh, escape out of that and we're going to go to a race because that's really what we want to do so we'll skip session and this was practice so we'll need to skip I think we need to skip the next race session as well let's do that and then we'll be in race mode skip session okay here we go so we're on the grid with 20 I think 23 other cars I'm at the back so let's see if I've got Sebastian Vettel on pole of course so let's see if we can at least stay on the back of everybody <laughs> red and ready to go go that in real life can you hold on apologies again I was treading on the wrong pedal what an amateur Somebody spun there. There was somebody on my left, so I had to back out of that a little bit. Let's concentrate on. Nailing the apexes. Oh, on my inside. Come on, come on, come on, come on.
gentle lift and nail a throw. Gentle lift here. Bus stop and nail it. I think the back stepped out there. So it's four lap race, flat out, bit of a shimmy going up the hill, getting the draft, in the toe, in the toe, in the toe, and duck out. Come on. Oh, back stepped out again. He wants to get past again, no chance. Overcooked it. Damn it. Lost a lot of time on that one. Much better line up the hill this time. Nice. Probably getting better with every lap, and I think I need a longer gear, sixth gear. Ah. Let's hunt this guy down. a little bit and nail it. Flat out I think this time. Come in. Yes. Pick the toe. Oh, oh he spun me around. That was nice of him. That screwed up our race. Oh well. If you don't try, you don't know. Sideways going up the hill at about 200.
He is way off in the distance, unfortunately. So if anybody's interested in this setup that I'm using, it's in the uh, description for the video, for the stream and the video. Hit my breaking point correctly that time. Okay. That's it. Race over. The way that I come, I can't quite see where I've come. Oh, that was hard work. I'm not in the top ten, quite clearly. Nineteenth. Well, I didn't come last. I didn't come last, so but I did get punted. Woo! I did get punted. Right. Should we try? Let's try something different. Um, no, excuse me. I'm figuring this out as I go along. It's navigating menus in VR is not the easiest thing to do. So let's escape. <laughs> what am I doing? Here? Should be able to escape. And there's no menu. Oh, help me out. How do I get out of this? <laughs> I'm locked in my copy. I can't get out. Mate, help me, can you? <laughs> uh. Press escape and nothing's happening. again entry list timetable someone want to tell me what I'm doing wrong I haven't can't quite figure it out but this is the only thing I'm seeing on the screen ah now I'm in the pits that's all very nice but I'd like to do something different. I can change my views, that's lovely. It's like we're all queuing up for something. We're not quite sure what. So this game is um, it's called Assetto Corsa, one of the best driving sims out there for PC at the moment, if you can work out how to use it. That was a, a good race, although I came not too high up. Maybe we just need to kill this thing. Do that. There, yeah, I think that worked. Don't know what went wrong there. Right, so uh, you won't be able to see this, but I'm uh, in the menu system, so I'm going to do something different now. How about um, Lamborghini? 
everybody likes a Lamborghini or there's a Pagani <clears throat> I will work this out actually so um, people can watch the menus but Lamborghini and let's try the Sesto Elemento which is not a road going Lamborghini and we'll, we'll try that around Spa as well opponents I'll add in lots of different other Lamborghinis I think I think they're all La no, there's Ferraris in there as well um, so excuse me while I do this I'm going to quick race actually that'll make things easier the same the summary bear with me This might be more difficult. I certainly haven't practiced that much on this. So we're, we're on Spa again, because like, I think it's important that you know the track. <laughs> Control, delete. Yeah, I think I should, maybe should have tried that. So anyway, we're, we're not going to do uh, quali or anything like that. Let's hope this works. If it doesn't, then we'll have to call it a day, frustratingly. Please hold. It's telling me loading on the on the rift. Ah, there we are. Okay, so already. So we got a nice uh, field of cars again. Twenty-three cars. What's that over there? Is that a Zonda? It's definitely a Pagani of some description. And a few others. All right. Let's make sure my headset's right. We got a definitely got a Ferrari up there ahead. All right. Let's go. Like that on the back of the Zonda is oh little tap the adaptive uh, dynamic braking he's got on the back of that fantastic graphics even that's a, a, a dynamic downforce isn't it At least don't have as much grip as an F1 car, obviously. But let's just stay on the back. Might get past. I don't know. We got some uh, got some grunt. Earlier breaking point. So I'm driving a Lamborghini Siesto Elemento. Not even a road legal Lamborghini, this one. I remember when they uh, test drove this on uh, Top Gear. Beautiful looking thing. Right up this Zonda's exhaust pipe. Oh yeah, yeah, come on. I think that's another Sesto Elemento in front of us. Ride the curb. Overtake opportunity up here, I think. <sighs> Excuse me, coming through. Mm. 
Is that a hurricane? Oh, I don't know my Lamborghinis that well. And obviously I can't read chat while I'm doing this. I hope you're enjoying it as much as I am. I've got used to the VR now. I was feeling a little queasy earlier on. Oh, it was sideways. Drift this. Lambo. Ah! <laughs> Nice detail in the mirrors. All right. Tuck it in the corner. Don't mind if I follow through as well, do you? For anybody wondering out there, I know this is an RC, but you know what? I this is what I enjoy doing. I've wanted to do this for a long time, actually. I used to play uh, driving games a lot as a kid. And this was a long time ago. Anybody who remembers the Jeff Crammon series of um, F1 games? I think it came on three and a half inch floppy disks. <laughs> That's how long ago. Well, didn't carry too much speed through that corner. Well, if they do leave the door open like that, what are you going to do? Oh, come on! What's he doing? Dirty driving. Has to be said, I've got aggression turned up to uh, 100%, so it's to be expected. So again, this is a four lap race. At least I'm fast in the straight line. Just not terribly fast around the corners. Got a right gaggle of supercars here. Might have slowed out. Well, I'm not last. Oh, come on. I suppose anything's going to seem slower than an F1 car, isn't it? I should have started with this first, really. See if I can get on the back of these guys. Get the apex right here. Oh. Just screwed up my gears. Well, I... 
made a better job of that sequence. Mildly off track. Oh, he likes his brakes, doesn't he? Come on, switch to the inside. Definite penalty for that one. going sideways around most of these corners. Could be the last lap. I've lost count. Race over. Sixth place! Not bad! And I don't think I did pull any dirty manoeuvres there. And I had Schumacher in front of me. Ah, oh, it would be nice to catch him up. Woo! Not bad. That was good. <sighs> Warming up now. So let's see what we can do. Let's exit. You can't go between outside and inside of VR, you have to do the uh, the menus in the VR as well. Okay. So, sixth place, not bad. I would have thought I would have been better at the F1 actually, I've had more practice at that. Let's, um, let's pick a different car. What else have we got? Oh, I know. I know what we could do. We could do some monster. Uh, no. Oh. Alfa Romeo, Aldi. Ah, oh, here we go, yes. Aldi R18. Now, <laughs> you unleash it on Spa. I think Spa is a bit a bit too small for the R18 but opponents you know, we've got all our opponents summary uh, just, just bear with me
do, 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 that's, I'm going to turn down aggression a bit. <laughs> because they were very aggressive in the last race, the AIs. Okay. So here we go. Another four lap, four lapper. I think once you try it, VR, actually, you won't want to race in any other way. It's because you can actually turn, you can see, turn into the eight, look into the apexes and uh, just better judge the racing line. Okay, look at this monster. Look at all the dials. <laughs> Look at the way it sounds. <laughs> now, by rights, I should sail through the field because I'm in a I mean, about as good a racing car as you're you're gonna ever have. Type of thing they use at Le Mans in the 24-hour race. Don't know how it breaks, we'll find out. Ferrari in front of me. Oh. Come on, Porsche. Oh, I love that Porsche. We'll have him. Oh, somebody booted me up in the back. Thank you very much. Didn't matter. Oh, I love this car. Being very polite. Oh, he nice, oh, not very nice. Thought I turned down aggression. dive in kind of deserve that excuse me coming through super lagara
Menzo. Oh, great. No idea where I am. I like how you can do that. You can look into the apex and uh, judge your breaking point really well and your turning point. Up the hill, flat out. Surely turned in too early, really. Don't mind. The last lap? No. One more lap. Still haven't mastered that. You would have thought this would do it flat out if the F1 car can. First place! Well, no great surprise. I'm driving a Le Mans 24 hour type car, aren't I? Through a pack of supercars. Woo! Come on. 
can't hear how it sounds. I don't know what that means. I thought that we tested to get the game sound earlier, so I'm hoping you can hear it okay. All right, so I'm going to just go back to F1 and try uh, one more F1 race, see if I can do better on that. So... Excuse me while I set this up quickly. And again we'll do four laps. Opponents are visible. Very good. Hey Leo, how are you doing? Condor Soaring Simulator. Doesn't ring a bell, but I'll look that one up. That sounds interesting. Soaring. You mean like gliding? Alright. Let's go. Four more laps of Spa in the Ferrari F2004. Concentrate its time, less talking, more driving. Go. Uh, get what? I got punted. Excuse me while I restart, that's not fair. No, you can't do that in real life, but when you're in a sim, you can. Go.
Oh, nice corner. Definitely hooking that hairpin up better each time now. Flat out up the hill, perfect that time. Catch some toe. Whoa! Nearly up the boot. Come on, move. See ya. Last lap.
the apex. Where I come fourth. <laughs> oh, that is so much fun flying through from the back of the field. Oh, my arms. Right, that has definitely hit four races back to back. But only four lappers. Oh, these I need to work out. Okay. No sound from the sim. I'm finding out at the end. Okay. Okay, I'll have to uh, try and resolve that. We tested that earlier and it was working okay, so something's gone wrong part way through the stream. Okay, so that's it. Thanks for watching. Our first um, go with VR and on this new um, racing rig uh, with the frame and the Fanatec um, steering wheel and shifter and pedals bolted into that and this amazing 34-inch um, screen as well, Dale, Dell Alienware and the oculus rift um, goggles as well and i'll tell you what the other thing is you might think i'm weird but wearing gloves when you're sim racing i've heard it's really important these um, st um steering wheels can really eat up your hands and uh, cause you blisters and all types of problems and i have to say my hands still do feel feel good after all that okay so thanks for watching this one we'll be back with probably some flight sim action next time on this new uh, amazing pc but um that we've got it's the amazing top spec nvidia graphics card i9 intel i9 processor 32 gigs of ram so it's like a, a monster should be able to do anything with this so thanks for watching this one subscribe to the essential rc youtube channel we are going to cover rc stuff and this gaming sim type stuff as well i think there's quite a close relationship uh, especially flight sims um to um rc stuff as well and we want to kind of make the channel as broad as possible um you might like some of it you might like all of it. it it doesn't really matter you just choose what you'd like to watch but if you do subscribe then thanks very much okay so thanks for now see you next time